what's going on guys welcome back to the channel today we're gonna be checking out some more jojo's bizarre adventure today we're gonna be doing two episodes as always man don't worry man two episodes is all you need two episodes is all i need you know what i'm saying um we we i, I i'm not in no hurry to catch up to jojo's because it's a lot <laughs> you know what i mean it's a lot of episodes so i'm not in no hurry to catch up to it um but i am enjoying the series you guys know that right so um we got jojo and caesar going up against well it was just jojo or joseph that went up against <clears throat> one of the the three um um um, it's this right? Is he is he this? Is he this? Yeah, is he this? Right? Um, went up against that one of the pillar men and seemed to have beat him, but it seems like he's attached himself to jo Joseph's back, right? As a like a parasite, maybe he's gonna be there, invisible. I don't know. I don't know. All I know is that. He's not dead. He is not dead. So it's yet to be seen. But jo Joseph did a pretty good job of defeating him, in my opinion. Um, I don't think he expected that out of Joseph. But at least the poison thing that it has been taken off of his windpipe. So there's still another one there. He has to beat another one of them to get the other one off. But at least one of them is gone. So that's where we are right now so let's go check out these episodes and i will see you guys for the review all right so that was jojo's bizarre adventure episode 18 and 19 yes so it's just so funny with this series oh you know you're watching it and you're like oh you want to you know push the envelope a little bit with this series but it's kind of like the way how it's going right now i'm enjoying the pacing the pacing is really good like um you know, I was talking during the episode and I was saying to you, like, there's a lot of tropes in this anime that you can see that a lot of animes, like, they take these exaggerations from this anime. You get what I'm saying? Um, so it's kind of like, I appreciate it. I really do. I really appreciate that stuff because it's not, in some animes, when you see that stuff, it's like, it's very corny and very cheesy and it's not, it's not laughable. It's not funny. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Like, it's not so funny. But JoJo, they do it so well because of the, vo the voice acting. It does it so well. It makes you feel like you're actually in the the anime experience in this firsthand. It's like, you're going up against an enemy and they're like, I knew you were going to do that. That's why I did this. I did this because you did this. Oh, you fell for it. <laughs> It's very exaggerated, but it's funny in, in, in JoJo's, you know, and I appreciate that. Now, according to the story, um, so ACDC is officially dead, um, and now we have Cars, which is, he's basically wants the stone, but they prevented him from getting it. He's pretty lit. He can control light, which is yet to be seen how he does that i mean it was a slight demonstration but i think it can go he can go beyond that okay and then we got we we didn't see whammo at all um during this time or wham whatever um so i don't know what's going on with caesar i don't want to sit here and speculate anything because i'm not really sure what's going on with him he says he's um, basically, Lisa Lisa said that Jojo said something that touched on his past, you know, that really triggered him to do this right now. Now, he said some stuff to Jojo that I completely agree with. You can't just, you know, but then again, I agree with something that Jojo said after that, which is 
you know, Caesar said to him that you can't just, you know, I think that because of, you know, because of what was going on, you would have inherited, you know, what our grandfathers went through and who killed our grandfathers. So you basically, you know, inherit their revenge in some sort of way. Um, but what Jojo said back to him, you know what I'm saying, is like, it makes no sense to, to die for people who are not even here. You get what I'm saying? So to be reckless about it is not the same thing as going about it the right way. You get what I'm saying? So that's the rebuttal from Jojo, which I actually like. But Caesar was also very truthful in what he said. Like, I believe in that. I believe that um, not necessarily the revenge, but more of like if somebody dies doing something or doing something special. That's why you have so many kids that, you know what I'm saying, they go in the military and stuff like that when they grow up because their dad did it and their grandfather did it, you know what I'm saying, and their great-grandfather was in the army and stuff like that. To this day, those traditions are still in the United States, something that I really um, like, you know what I'm saying, following in each other's footsteps, serving the country and all that other stuff is pretty cool. Now, to be as reckless, no. You know what I'm saying? Like, if if that person died being reckless, that don't mean you got to go about it the same way and die being reckless. Like, you know, so I appreciate those lines. In any case, man, Lisa Lisa is, is, a, is a dime. You know what I'm saying? I don't mean to disturb my talking, but you know what I mean? And y'all say somebody is going to come into this series prettier than her? Like, damn. I hope it's not Susie Q. I hope it's not Susie Q. Okay? I hope it's not Susie Q. All right? So, not much else to say here. Uh, hopefully, dude can stop Caesar from um, from going in the house, you know, so they can formulate a better strategy. Yes, you got the upper hand because it's daytime, but at the same time, why would he leave himself defenseless just sitting in the house the whole time? You get what I'm saying? Um, so you might put yourself at a disadvantage because it's not like cars can't take on four of y'all. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, he's outnumbered, but he's that powerful. You got to respect your enemy. It's kind of like what they set back up from, you know, when they finally destroyed ACDC in the in the, in the first um, in episode 18, where Jojo was like, there's I still have a profound amount of respect for him, even though he was an evil dude. You know what I mean? So, um, so that was great. That was a good confirmation of, you know what I'm saying? You still got to show your enemy respect. You can't just think they're idiots just because it's daytime. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? And I think right now Caesar is acting on emotions, which is not something you usually see him do. As a matter of fact, he was teaching Jojo to stop acting on emotions like that. And now he's the one that's in that position. It's kind of weird to see him like that, but I guess something really triggered him i guess we're going to learn a little bit more about his secret past in the next coming episodes anyways thank you guys so much i appreciate you guys leave a like on the video and also leave a comment in the comment section if you want to you get what i'm saying i appreciate you guys when you do that please do okay leave a comment in the comment section let me know what you thought of these two episodes the first time you watched it and also subscribe if you're new it's your boy terabyte reacts and i'm out peace